Good morning, Pisces. How are you? How you doing? All right, Pisces. Put my oils on. Thank you for all those who like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, sorry about the class, but the internet here was not working. So I have to pursue the class on Saturday. This is my Palo Santo that I use, made by me. That's right, that's right. Made by me. So, um, I will be having something going on that I will show you how to do certain things, uh, sage and things like that. Uh, because when I do my reading, I cannot be doing everything else on a reading, on a private reading. So, it takes a lot out of it. So, this is the bell calling in the spirits. I put my oils on. I want to get started with this reading. Thank you for all those who like, share, subscribe to my channel, give donation, get private readings, and go on to my web, my store, purchase my rocks, my oils, my candles, uh, my salt baths are the bomb, okay, my bracelets, thank you a million for all those who do that, I'm so grateful of you and for you, I pray that all, everyone has woke up feeling better than they did yesterday, all right, all right, Pisces, I've been shoveling, shoveling these cards, all right, let's go, let's see what Pisces need to know. Let's see what Pisces need to know. All right. Spirits, garden angels, come into my reading. Let me know what Pisces need to know. Judgment. Somebody is awakening to everything. Also, somebody has judged themselves, judged others, but most of all, they hard on themselves. But this particular car, I love because it shows you enjoying listening to music, playing music. Um, the uh, butterfly seems like um, it's a transformation here. It's the knowing. Um, not only that is this mountain is so so tall and it's uh, it's 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 like a rock. Well, this particular mountain is so tall and the trees are green and the grass is green and you are looking towards a path. But as you're moving along the path, you're, you're doing it beautifully and you're happy, okay? You are happy to be in this awakening, to knowing, to seeing, to feeling this new, whole new thing with you, okay? Um, with um, judgment, that is the number 20 and you hit 21, then you are done. You got the world. Um, a new um, awareness, how you see things, okay? You're not letting nothing get to you as normally, okay? Judgment, hello, Essence, I invite you to show up every day. I invite my soul to shine unapologetically. That means you're not going to continue to apologize. You good. You are so good. You're not going to continue to apologize, right? It says a self realization and understanding and spiritual awakening a redemption knowing your emotions and your heart to be true totally transformation a glory unveiling of a spirit okay you have judged others and have been judged yourself you have been judging others and been judged yourself and you are awakening to the understanding that you, that the only approval that you, that really matters is your own. Okay, you judge others, others that judge you. But in reality, you come to awakening that you don't give a fuck. And the only thing that matters is your own approval. You don't have to continue to keep um, looking for someone's approval. You really don't, right? Are you doing your best with others and with yourself, it's time to share, share, um, it's time for you to let go of any negative, okay, 
any negative thoughts, okay, or feelings that you're going to, drop the mask behind the mask. It may feel risky, yet this profound act of self-accepting will unleash your absolute essence. You are a light shadow, okay? Your light shadow matters, okay? You are a miracle. Why then do you keep your true nature self hidden away from the world? There is no way to really understand your full potential until you are open and honest with yourself and your own heart, okay? Without judgment, okay? To expand and, and, um, and grow, you need to be out in the open. It's something here that's saying it's time for you to grow. It's time for you to move on. It's time for you to make yourself open and to be seen because if you're not seen and you're not open, how people are going to get to know your full potential? Okay, stop hiding your talents is another way of making money. It's saying open up to whatever it is that you put on the side. Go back and get it. You don't need nobody's approval to do anything. You're looking in a in a good way. You're moving the right way. Okay, you're moving the right way. Um, it's a good thing because it's a new awareness, enlightenment, uplifted, a full scene of reality, the truth, accept worthy of yourself, open up a challenge for facing, um, you know, what you want to do. Um, and that's what you need to do. All right. You come into reality. This may be Scorpio. Okay. Um, yes. Uh, judgment, Pluto. Okay. Pluto. All right. What is your representation are you still in alignment with? Are you still in alignment with it? It may be time for you to honest to honestly self um do the certain assignment that you've been putting on the back that you don't want to do. The nature of uh, precision is no longer as an option. You need to do it. All right. Um, you need to move forward with something here. You need to do it. And that's what you do. You need to do it and stop putting yourself um, on a back burner for everybody else. And this is about a whole new way of making money, a whole new way of seeing things. If you don't um, do things, then I don't know how you expect to, uh, to make money, okay? You, it's another mean of making money to be seen, being heard, okay? Um, it's a higher understanding, advancement, uplifted, okay? A full scene of really, a reality. A time to elevate, a realization of a significant um, importance, in, moving to a higher level of awareness. A completion understanding makes life easier to navigate through, okay? The sense of your worth, okay? Um, an undeniable happiness. A, pot, a precision is better um, in your environment. And that's where you feel yourself that you need to move forward. And when you move forward, you do a lot of good things, but it seems like you hide in your talent. You, 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 you don't need nobody's approval on it. You need to be seen to make a difference. And if you do this, you will see that it's a whole new way of making income. It's a whole new way of what, how you see yourself. You don't need nobody to approve of it. You need to move on. Now, it got the two of cups, the love. So here, you don't need nobody approval. It seems like you need to move on with a situation. Instead of sitting there in the land, that you need to move forward with it. Why delay it? Why? What? What? Why are you delaying the situation? Okay, you don't need nobody's approval to move on with your life. Who said you do? 
whoever told you that, they lie. Maybe before you had to do things around the way people wanted you to do it, but you no longer have to. Um, with the two of cup is making a choice, an opportunity, but you need to, the judgment is you need to move forward. You're coming into awakening when you don't need to impress or not even impress, like get hit or hide yourself from being seen. Okay. Um, uh, a, uh, commitment for, from the heart, good choice or clear, clearly seen. A decision is making to, um, a decision is made to move forward from your heart, okay? Um, it's like, it's like a bond, it's your expectation, it's something that you need to move forward, but you need, it's like a mind made over a heart decision, head over heart decision, right? A new awareness and an understanding of another. A mutual cooperation to um, commit to a goal, all right? Uh, so you need to make a move, partnership, commitment, a wholesome, a truth, a mutual understanding. So here's some, you need, okay, so you don't need nobody's opinion, approval about how you make a move or what decision you're going to make. You come to the awareness now that you don't need nobody's approval. All right, to make a choice for a new opportunity in what in love with a person, a career, you can do anything you want with this, but you need to move forward with it. You don't need to be stuck there. You need to move forward with a decision about a person. And here it's funny because you're giving, um, you're giving fish to someone as always. Pisces, you are the one that always giving. And it's like toasting, but you, the cat down here, is giving. All right? You, you, you need to be seen, honey. The sun is shining over this calm body of ocean. Okay? The sun is reflecting over you and this person. Look at that. Look at that. All right? Show me more. Show me more with this two of cups is. Um, and it's also um, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer there. Then you got the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is the shit, the beauty in you, <coughs> what makes you who you are. Okay? You got the Queen of Wands. You are powerful. You are very powerful. You know what you want. You know how to go get it. And people say the Queen of Wands is that person that's, very, very sexy, right? A sexy individual, all right? So here you got to make, you don't need nobody's approval. You need to make a move to move on. But the two of cups is an, a new opportunity. It's taking action, all right? With a new opportunity. Um, the queen of cups, you got, uh, the queen of wands, you got next to that patience. The uh, diplomatic, right? Um, uh, a, 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 a quest of, of, of strength, of understanding, um, participation, um, uh, things seen clearly, all right? Loving concern. It's like you, you're beautiful. When you walk in the room, everybody looks at you. It's like you got that sexual appeal. It's like you sassy at the same time, okay? Um, but you very, very giving, all right? Things are seen clear, good judgment. And the good thing is you got the 20 car, right? Pluto, and now you got the queen of wands. But you got to, it's an opportunity for a change. But you got to make a choice here. So you got judgment in the beginning, and then you got judgment now, right? So you judging this, all right? And it's a good judgment. Um, uh, um. You got to move forward. The thing is that the cat is looking at you, giving you a rose. So this is a good choice you're making to whatever choice you're making, you're doing it. And it's the right choice with you and a person. Okay. Uh, sounds, um, decisions are made based on royalty. Okay. 
from a right place, a precision energy um, to, to have. Inspiration leadership is recognized by others, all right? Graceful dip diplomatic will ratchet rewards. You are going to be beautiful because you're making the right choice. You're making the right choice here. Okay? So, also what came out next to the queen is another queen. The queen of pentacles. Like, um, the queen of pentacles is a little different. Now, when you look at the Queen of Pentacles, right, you, you, you're looking at somebody that's, or maybe somebody here, elegant, with the strength, respectful position, respectful history, influence over peers, in, uh, uh, honest um, integrity, a graceful influence, okay? Um, a clear focus, a time to move forward with thoughts of goals. Your presence and influence are high. Your ideas are truth, okay? A time to take advancement of a status others will follow. Um, pursuing is the strength, okay? So if you look at the queen patient, okay? So here you got you sit high in your in your precision. Now this does have two queens on there. Two, not one. All right. So maybe you embodying both of these queens, or maybe a person is seeing two people. All right. Who knows? Or if I look at it, because it fell right next to the other queen. It can be this judgment. It's like you really moving forward. But you got a lot of cats around you. You got a cat. You may have a lot of cats, but it's a one cat that's giving you flowers, and then this cat is sitting on top of your money while the other cats are all at your feet. See, somebody knows that, you're, that you really got it going on, but it seems like you got a lot of suitors too, okay? A lot of suitors here. Experience, tell me what this... A ten of cups is the six of cup pisces scorpio cancer you're going through your heart it's like everything is looking good okay because i see wands i see pinnacles and i see cups someone from your past somebody that you're working with someone that you know for a long time um coming into this um awareness within yourself working with somebody okay the Six of Cups, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. So you got a lot of cups here. A lot of people, a lot of actions are being taken, right? A lot of action moving forward. A better understanding restores the truth. Somebody wants to restore the truth. I want you to have truth in them. I want you to um, trust them. Um, a situation because uh, becomes peaceful. See what I mean? Um, acceptance being back brings back happiness into one's life, all right? Um, persevere, um, all right? You got a lot of good things coming. It's important. Important issues are addressed and dealt with. A coming to terms on the situation brings peace and harmony. So whatever it is that you're going through, it's like you're, you're coming happy. It's like, you're coming back to an understanding that whatever communication wasn't communicated, communicated right with a person. This person wants you to be a part of whatever it is. Sit down and have a talk. Making amends. Forgiveness. Okay? A new friendship. Building. Caring. Um, you can be a healer. Sharing. Um, you can be um, something returning. Um, um, with a lot of potential support, uh, valuing you, valuing your truth, um, justification, truth, believe, understanding, forgiveness, importance, the strength, partnership, making amends, stronger than before, honey. This is something that's coming bigger and stronger than before. 
about two people. All right? Our understanding of what it was. Sitting out having to talk about everything you've been through. Okay? Moving forward in a relationship. In a friendship. But it's something here that you're toasting up. And to me, it seems because under... On the website NBCNews.com, because they say, a situation is that space between a committed relationship and something that is more than a friendship. To find out more, look for the link in your Google Home or Google Assistant app. That just came out on its own. I ain't even asked no question. It just popped up on its own. The two, so you got the two of cups coming back together, and then you got the six of cups. Someone from your past or someone here that you know that you didn't talk to or had a breakup with and y'all not communicating something, whatever, or it wasn't no understanding it wants to work with you. The four cups, you're taking a rest from all of this. You put a lot of work. You was thinking too much. You know, all in your thoughts about something. But now you resting. You resting to ensure that everything is going to be okay. It seemed like whatever you went through, you went through a lot. Okay? And not only that, it seemed like you had to um, sit down and, and, and chill out after all this talking and getting back or whatever. It's being stable. It's, be, it's, it's belonging. Belonging. Again, it's telling you belonging. Belonging to what? To a situation that had no understanding. Okay? Uh, planning. Um, it's like making plans. Arrangements. Making a plan to discuss something with somebody. Okay? Um, the uh, what you expecting of this outcome, right? Uh, maybe scheduling of an action, something you lay back with. You're not moving fast. You're just doing the right thing. Um, so things remain on course, but no quick advice is in the near future. All right, no quitting is in the near future. Progress is slow, but issues are recognized with a need to improve. So everything is going to be working out, but you still need to relax. And things still need to be improved. Um, patience for new. Pay, uh, uh, be a uh, patient for the new is best, right? Not a time for action. Things are understood clearly. A, chance, a change will come in time. So between you and this person, all this understanding you're coming with, things, it's like you need to take a rest. Don't move on fast. Don't do this and do that. Just still be calm and cool about shit. You ain't got to go crazy because somebody's talking to you again, rushing to be with them, rushing to have them. No, take your time, right? That's what it's telling. Um... You got to be, uh, maybe this is um, being calm, silent, still, okay? Um, it's saying have patience while you are uh, processing everything. A formal way of seeing things, planning, recording, um, uh, you know, seeing things in a pattern, scheduling, uh, um, being a, a mentor or something here. Just lay back and observe everything you're going through because I feel like you are, um, well, we're in the same cars, okay? You are going through something in awakening with a person, all right? Might have been from your past, all right? The Two of Cups, the Queen of Wands, very excited, beautiful. When you come in, everything is cool. It can be sharp with the mouth, sassy, but giving. Beautiful. They look at you like a sex object. Okay, but you in tune with yourself. Because not only that, it shows another queen here, the queen of pentacles. You got it going on, but you got a cat that wants to give you a flower. Then you got a cat sitting on top of your mud. It's like somebody knows you put together. Does somebody here from the past or whatever want to come back? Okay, or want to work with you. They want to work with you. And with however slow, fast you move it, that's the way they want to go. All right, but you're saying I'm just going to chill on this and I'm going to think about more and just move slowly. All right, tell me more about this queen. But you're being the six of wands, you are being parade. 
for everything, for your accomplishment, for the way that people are seeing you. Like this, you're being parade, honey. You're being seen, okay? But there's an ending to this, all right? This king or whoever feels like they're being parade on, okay? Um, and it's a man, okay, on this picture, all right? Uh, somebody sitting on their glory, excuse me. Somebody tell me more about this. It's a new beginning. That's what it is. Something that you at the end had to come to for, for you to start a new beginning. So maybe, like I said, it's too, because I see the Queen of Wands and the Queen of Pentacles and being parade, okay? But then something here, once some, the Empress, look at that. I asked for the death card. It's a new beginning. But at this new beginning, because something's got to end for something to begin. Something's got to stop for something to start, right? You got the empress, right? This song looks like she's pregnant, but with that new beginning, that end to a new beginning shows the empress embodying all of these queens. Embodying all the queens, being all of those queens in one. Being caring, giving, nurturing, um, looking at things for the truth, looking for the truth. All right, nothing can pass you. Um, looking at everything from your heart, understanding, cooperation here, um, building. I'm giving birth to something new, or actually giving birth to a child. All right, um, working hard. You can make anything happen with anybody. Okay. Uh, but everything seems like it's moving smoothly here. Nothing is like. Uh, Moving fast. Everything seems like it's going smooth. Uh, you're very creative at this time in your life. Very creative. All right? Uh, um, the thing about this is um, with this, uh, the, the queen after this death car, right, um, shows um, where you are at in your life. Okay? Abundance. Beauty. The mother of nature, energy, a cycle of life, facility, fertility, flowers, creativity, a new life, a, a, a start of a new ins inspiration, growth and abundance, and it said a new life. So you have to end something to get a new life and another situation. Okay, um, an idea to be had. The ideal is to be in a reality, okay? Um, the mother of all invention, creativity, energy flowing freely within yourself, right? Abundance, all right? Uh, open mind, an essence of life, a non-judgment, um, nurturing, healing, manifesting, nursing. Okay, abundance, wealth, rich, all right, um, harboring, you have a lot of stuff going here, but that is after this death card that you need to understand that you're too good, okay, and the death card is the number 13, so you got, you got, all of this after everything that you're going through is a beautiful thing. Because the death is like cleanness, a new birth. And that's crazy because you got the emperor. And this is definitely a new start. Why I say that? Because you got the death. Then you got the emperor. To death mean ending something to start nothing new. To start something new. The emperor is giving birth to something new. So it's definitely something new here that's going to begin. All right? A cleanness, a new birth, okay? Um, a new uplifting, vibration, a change, transformation. And that's what it is all about. The death card is transformated. A major shift in idealism, okay? A new horizon to be experienced, all right? The rising sun brings new life. The rising sun brings new life. So it's the new beginning here. Change in a spiritual release, new understanding of the spiritual thing. You're going to spiritual transformation. 
bringing in the new and releasing the old, right? And also, it's what the whole card saying to you is, you need to release what no longer is serving you. And it's a, a it could be a releasing of understanding, a, a, a miscommunication, how you see things, right? Uh, necessarily, cycles are coming to an closure. So things are coming to an end. Um, it can mean um, the ending of a cycle, a new horizon, a start of a cycle. So you got to end the cycle to start a cycle. Closure, transformation, okay? Um, purification, harvest, cleanness, um, swept away, right? Um, birth, a new beginning, a renewal, a higher level understanding, liberation, surrender, depart. A total awareness, a completion, all right? So what I do see here is that, tell me more about this four swords, the four swords. Well, you got two cards here, and you, oh my God. You got the eight of wands, things are moving fast. Everything that was big to you, that was so big in your life that you worried so much about, is becoming small to you, all right? Um, somebody, maybe you make it, taking a trip. Maybe you feel like you don't feel like um, being in an energy that doesn't serve you anymore. You're looking at things on how to do things in a different way. But something here is moving very quickly in your life, all right? No resisting, clear, a clear, clean slate, self-made um, decision, a positive action, swept away to something new. And that's what it's telling you. A good outcome move forward. Clear direction and instruction to um, move you out of a situation, right? A time to take advantage of a skill in the matter of concern. A good vision point points um, the new ability to move things in your advantage, okay? Uh, it's something here that you need to move on in the, your whole reading. This whole reading is saying to me to tell you, okay? Um, judgment, it's time to move forward. You, you, you judge, they judge you, you judge yourself too hard, but you got the queen of pentacles, and this is not only that, it's like you being moved forward. It's like people are looking at you, they're happy for you, right? Moving into a parade, and this, this, this six of one is where people are happy, but this is a different, this is like a, a parade, like they're acknowledging you, like a, a speech where people gather to hear, seeing you for the accomplishment that you made, all right? For the kid, for all the things that you do for people, people are acknowledging you for everything, all right? You got the two of cups, two people. Coming together, understanding, um, going through everything they went through, but now they understand. They can talk, they can communicate. All right. Is someone from your past come and return? Want to work with you? Want to mend things? Want to be able to talk to you? Okay. Open communication. Um, making things better than what it was. All right. Um. Maybe this person worked in a flower shop. Maybe they bring you flowers. Um, they work for their own. But it's something here that is given to you, all right, from this person. This person's handled you a bouquet of flowers. Maybe Valentine. Something here is coming up, all right. The death card, it had to be an ending to be a rebirth, all right. Someone from your past had to come and end all the nonsense that y'all was going through. All right, not getting along, um, not seeing each other, whatever it is, it had to end for it to begin. Scorpio, you got the emperor again giving birth to something new, something exciting. All right, having a real child, but here is abundance coming your way, and it is flowing in every direction. Everything is calm. You, you, you're a care person. You do everything in the right way. Somebody here sees it. You're coming to understand where everything at one time was like real messy. 
no understanding, arguing. You know what I mean? But now you're coming to understand where everything is going to be good. You can be at peace with yourself. The Queen of Wands, she looking there. Someone's trying to get attention to give her flowers. So, And in the other card, it says, here's somebody's handing you flowers, right? The Four of Swords, Gemini Libra Aquarius. The best thing about this, you only got one card, the Four of Swords. And it's a good, good card. It's you sit back, taking it easy. Now that everything is flying through, you feeling better about even being able to talk to somebody you haven't talked to in a long time. Y'all ain't getting along. But everything is moving in a better way with your car, within yourself, within a situation. Okay? Bringing peace to someone. Bringing peace to yourself. A relationship. Okay? Whatever it is. If it ain't going to be a relationship, a friendship. But things are moving fast. You may be moving. You may... The, this situation is moving fast, okay, on another level. The Queen of, uh, the queen of uh, Pentacles shows up twice, at the beginning and at the end. So you're going to be, it's like, here is, you had everything. You got your food, you got everything, your trees is looking good, everything, okay? But it seems like, they judge you, you judge yourself. It was like a lot of judging and all of this crap going on at one time. But now you start all over from scratch. The trees are blooming leaves, which means it's a new beginning. You got a rabbit, luck, okay? A lot of luck coming your way. Um, Maybe around Easter, April, things will be looking really good for you. You sitting on your coins, you holding on your coin. A lot of Leo around you. Are you seeing a Leo? Do you have Leo? Got a lot of green around you, which means that you're doing good. That you're going to be doing good. That you're going to come out of a situation that you're in. That you're going to start doing things in a different way. It's trying to tell you, don't hold back on nothing that you've been doing or wanting to do. A lot of flirting going to be going on in this relationship. Somebody's all in, honey. Somebody wants to be all in. They want to work with you. You can build a lot of things with this person. Release your ex. It's time has come for to clear this energy. So maybe you're in a party with another person and somebody needs to be released. Okay? Um, that was there. There needs to be going to make all everything else come good for you. And once you leave whatever it is, right, you become more attractive. Because when you're happy, you bring good attraction to you. When you feel good about yourself, you attract good things, okay? But you got to be happy, and you got to understand that nobody can make you happy like you. Nobody can control you like you, all right? I feel like you must feel like you're not making the money or, you know, you've been cut off like you've been, your money's been funny, your career's been funny, all right? Uh, because this is cutting off your grain or maybe somebody feel like you cut off their grain or you, you or leaving a person or something made your money funny, all right? Now it's like you taking completely care of yourself with no other help. Okay, but you need to choose what you want, and that's the thing. It's like I feel like you need to choose, and like you're so comfortable where you was, but it feels like if I make a wrong choice, it will hurt me. Well, sometimes things gotta hurt you for you to wake up, but it's beautiful things coming this way. But it seems like you must release someone once and for all, and not only that, it's like I don't know if you got two people you've known for a long time, but it's something here. That once you let go, everything is going to turn out right. Because the whole thing is of an awareness that you come through. That you need to be open to. To receive. Okay? That's what it is. It's maybe that you need to make a choice from the way you thought before to the way you think now. From the good, from the old to the new. Okay? It's a mutual man here that maybe knows both of y'all. All right? But this person look like they from another, maybe not from this world. Maybe they pass or whoever is from a, 
from not from this country, right? And it says um, um, the main female, unexpected income. So I feel like it's whoever this is, it's either you or them. But somebody here needs to cut off somebody's, a middleman. A middleman needs to be cut off, okay? That's the best way to put it, to get everything you want. Something in the middle needs to be cut off, okay? All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.